Hello everyone, Mauro here. In this video, we're going to look at the changes for Windows 11 build 26120.3000, or also known as the update KV5050103 in the dev channel. This previous part of the Windows 11 version 24H2 development, but it is unclear when these improvements will be available for everyone, including for those computers running version 23H2. Okay, let's look at the changes in the dev channel. But before, please subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people. It doesn't cost anything and you will be helping the channel and supporting my work. Now, before I proceed, I just wanted to let you know that this preview is a tiny update and a lot of the changes we have already seen. For example, option to show the battery percentage on the taskbar. So if you go to the power and battery page, you will now find an option to show the battery percentage. You can turn that on and off, and that's independent from the battery icon that appears on the taskbar, which is also getting a makeover. So if you turn on the option to show the battery percentage, this is how it's going to look on the taskbar. And as you can see, Microsoft is also making changes to the icon for the battery. So now if you see it green, that will indicate that the computer is currently charging and the battery is in good condition. Now, if you see the yellow icon, that indicates that your computer is actually running on battery power and it has started the energy saving mode. This mode automatically activates when the battery level drops to 20% or lower. Now, you may also see the icon in red and that is actually a warning that the battery is in a low state and it is critical to plug it back in in order to prevent unexpected shutdowns. Okay, I'm not gonna spend too much time on this, but the on-screen keyboard, actually the gamepad layout is back on Windows 11. The news here is that Microsoft previously removed it because they needed to fix some issues and now the layout is back. And that's it. Those are pretty much all the biggest changes that you're going to find on Windows 11 build 26,120.3000 or update KV5050103 in the dev channel. Let me know in the comments what you think about these changes and also let me know in the comments the type of content that you would like me to cover more in the channel. Also like the video, share it, and I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.